Hey there guys, it is your Muffin King back with another Would You Rather, and today I have a very special guest with me, um, but I will allow him to introduce himself. Go on ahead. Hello Earthlings, it's your favorite Super Elite Galactic Patroller Jacko here, and Goku, I thought I was here for an important mission. Well, you are here for an important mission. It's called Would You Rather, the epic game that everybody loves and everybody's playing. A game? Seriously? I am a space patrolman! I don't have time for games! Oh, come on, Jocko! Don't you ever have a little bit of fun? Uh, no. Okay, fine. I will do it. It really is a fun game. I'm, I I'm sure you'll like it. Okay, okay. Alright. Seeing as I'm here and Boma's already blackmailed me to do something for her anyway, I might as well do it. May I pray tell what is she blackmailing you for? Uh, I'd rather not say it's a it's a personal matter and it's just uh, uh anyway, let, let, what, what, what do we do what do we do what how do we play what do we do well well if you must know um would you rather it's just a game where you're asked two questions and you must decide what you would rather do over the other and depending on what the percentage is we'll decide if you are the victor or the loser all right okay I can do this Seems simple enough. Well, if you're ready, let's just jump into this. Let's do this. Here we go. The first would you rather question is, would you rather live in ancient Greece or live in ancient Egypt? Ooh, pyramids or Zeus? I don't know an awful lot about your earthly history, but I have flown past Egypt not long ago and those pyramids are stunning. Although, it does look awfully hot over there, so it's kind of difficult to say. I would probably, personally, say Ancient Egypt. Really? Very, very interesting. I, I have flown over Egypt, and I will admit, I will admit myself that those pyramids are very, very, very well made. Sturdy. I accidentally hit one. But, um, I think I'm gonna go, go, go with Greece. I've heard so much about Greece. And it just sounds awesome, in my opinion. Even though I like Egypt, no disrespect to Egypt, but Greece just sounds awesome. Any of you Egyptians out there watching, no disrespect. No no disrespect intended, but let's see who won this, shall we? Alright. Ah, And with 75%, yours truly is taking the lead! Awesome! Ah, oh, Earthlings, come on. Oh, don't feel too bad, Jocko. It's all in good fun. You also have to remember, I don't live on this planet. I don't know what's popular or not. I mean, to be fair, I'm not from this planet, but I've been raised on it. You live here! You're practically your whole life! True! True, but I- You're basically an Earthling. I- well- With ungodly powers that everybody seems to be able to not keep up with the level. <laughs> Which is totally unfair, by the way! Hey, 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 you're a space patroller. It's your job to protect the galaxy. You do realize that Tian Yamcha and Chao Tzu and Krillin all go to help meetings trying to get over this. Well, I can't- you No, know, years ago, when they were on the same level as you! Tien goes on and on and on and on about how he beat you in a tournament. And now, he wouldn't even be able to beat your pinky. I mean, to be fair, I was even holding back back then. <laughs> exactly, and you were a child. Yep. So how do you think he feels? He trains every single day oh, what's for years. Technically, he should be the strongest being in the universe. But he's not. Even even I think I could take Tien. Well, it's not my fault he's been slacking. Heck, Krillin's been training better than he has. I have to admit, Krillin's techniques have certainly advanced. Well, he has a nice wife to help him keep him on his toes, so to speak. Oh, doesn't he? I mean, he does, but... Let's just let's go to the next video! Ooh, I'm, I'm, I'm not disagreeing with you! Well, let's move on, darn it! Get caught up in good conversation! Would you rather... Right? Eat nothing but ketchup for a week, or eat nothing but mustard for a week? Oh, that's easy. You gotta go with the ketchup. I mean, mustard can get so warm and hot and burn your mouth. Yeah, it, it's it's just a bit too tangy for my taste. Not saying the ketchup's not. Yeah, it was that nasty tanginess that you just can't Ugh. get over. But to be fair, ketchup has a strong, just buttery, like, like thickness to it. Like when you put it in your mouth, right? It, it gets kind of overwhelming. Not, not to the- Exactly! And have you ever got mustard in your eye? Go Ted squirted me in an eye, in the eye, during a barbecue. And that's, that stuff stings! Okay, okay, you've you made your- I'm with you on this. I have to go with you on this one. We're both going with ketchup. Yeah! Let's see if we want or not. 
Wow, we won! Oh god, see? That was a no-brainer! A no-brainer with an overwhelming margin of 80%! Wow! Mm -mm. Uh, okay, D do you want to read this one? I do like ketchup. I like ketchup too. Would you rather be a capitalist or be a communist? Uh, hmm. Hmm. See, that's awfully controversial of you earthlings to ask such a question. It's kind of true. Uh, luckily, we don't have this kind of stuff out in space. But I have heard about communists and capitalists, and I personally would rather live a life of capitalism than communism, personally. But that's my opinion, personally. I mean, it's spending lots of money on useless stuff. But I feel it's an easier life to live. That's very true. Personally, I prefer socialism, but... Yeah, me too. You know, if I had to choose... Per I mean, it's just being a good person, in my opinion, but um, I would... I actually have to agree with you, capitalism. I mean, because it's like, I can spend whatever I want, so I can spend it to help people and do the right thing, and it's my choice. It's my money! Exactly! Instead of farming for turnips, you know? Uh, <laughs> don't get me started on the turnips. <laughs> I know you've done that before! <laughs> don't get me started on the turnips! Chi-Chi will not give me a break! How bad was Chi-Chi? She won't give me a break! She made Piccolo do it with Oh, <laughs> I saw that! Yeah, and he was not happy with you. Didn't talk to you for what, like two weeks? I mean, to be fair, he got a good workout. Even he admitted it was a nice little workout. So it all worked out. Why did Why did he just like split into four like he does during training? I have no idea. That would have got the job done so much quicker. No, I don't think we. I don't think any of us actually does that that much. I should be doing that with Chi Chi. Like, hey, Chi Chi, here's my my clone. I'm gonna go train now. Like, don't overwhelm the woman. Oh, training. Oh, okay. I'm just saying it's for training purposes and, and stuff. And of course, yeah. Yeah, but I was gonna say, you said split into people and then Chi Chi and I was, you know. What? Movie? I shouldn't be thinking these things, it's part of the, part of my law, but you know. Oh, Jocko, Jocko, for shame, Jocko. For shame. It's been a lonely few years, go. Leave me alone. I, I don't doubt that, but let's see who won this. I hope we won. Of course. Naturally. 66%, obviously. Like, we're killing this. Easy pickings. Well, I don't think we've lost one yet. Or... I lost one. I lost the first one. You're 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 winning one to nothing. Nice. Very very nice. Oh, ho, 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 this one's a tough one. If you were in a pinch, would you rather rely on the A team or rely on MacGyver? Oh, come on, the A team, dude. Have you seen that show? I have. It's the only show I get. I mean, uh, uh, you know, in the station, you know, back at headquarters, we love the A team there. Well, in fact, in fact, one time during the during the Halloween party, yours truly dressed up as one of the members of the A team. Oh, that was a fun night. That's so drunk. What what member were you dressing up as, if I if I may ask? I was Mr. T. Oh, I pity the fool who thinks that Jocko. Oh yeah, I, yeah, I was. I, yeah, I was. I pity. No, I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. But it was still fun, though. I, I guess you could say you love it when a plan comes together. I do. I do love it when the plan comes together. I mean, I, it is just so much more fun. I'm kind of with you on that. I, I personally, but MacGyver is awesome as well. I mean, I, I, I see the Shelly. I mean, I've heard of him. If the only man who could, who could stop a bomb from blowing up with. A, a two paper sticks and a rubber band. He, he's really, he's really versatile. I, I really like, but uh, uh, it's a tough. It's really a tough one because I, I don't know which one's more popular. I think the A team oh. might be a bit more popular. Well, uh, maybe. I, I, I'm torn. Go with your gut, Goku. I'm torn. Go with your gut. You always go with your gut. I'm going with the ah! Okay. And I lost. Yeah. <laughs> That's what all, bitch. Oh, sorry, I'm competitive. We are tied, and you're going to- you're going down, Jocko. You are so going down. Oh, we'll see about that. This might be the only thing I can beat you in, Goku! Oh, we're gonna find out, aren't we? We're gonna find out. Next question! Alright, would you rather be an anti-social genius or be a popular- or be popular but unintelligent? You know what? People already think- Popular and unintelligent! Popular and unintelligent as well because people already think I'm stupid, so why break the streak? I don't have any friends! So I want to be popular. I have lots of already, friends. I'm already anti-social genius. I might as well be a popular moron. Oh, true. And we both lost! Whoa, we both lost! Wow. What? 
<laughs> just love. People would rather be geniuses? Well, I suppose. Uh, who needs friends when you're smart, I guess. I guess so. Sounds like Jimmy Neutron or something, but... Um... That's like something Bulma would say. Actually, that's kind of, Well, no, I'm Bulma's friend. Yeah... Yeah, but it sounds like something she would say if she was pissed. True. V very, very true. Um... But yeah, let's move, move on. Oh my. You want to read this one? Nah, I would leave this one to you. Come on. Very well, very well. Would you rather adopt Pushing or adopt a Meow Cat? I don't know what either of those two things are. What are those? Very, very annoying internet things. I don't want either of them. They're both annoying. I mean... I don't want either of them then. I already have to deal with annoying things. It's called Bulma, Goten, and Trunks. Hey, 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 I had to deal with Trunks and Rosé and all his stupid slutty crap and, and his stupid wife who tries to put things up my butt. Yeah, but they're not annoying. They're relatively cool. They, they, they're strong and funny and whatever. No, 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 no. Bulma just tries to get things out of me with blackmail. Wait, wait. And, and Goten and Trunks pull my face because I look weird, apparently. Even though... Has Bulma ever tried to shove something up your butt? I'm just curious. I'm not obliged to answer that. Fair enough? Yes, okay? Yes. Once. Oh, oh! Well, well buddy, don't, don't, don't. It was more, it wasn't a sexual thing, it was more of a contraband thing. Like, oh, we can't get through customs with this, you're gonna have to shove it up your butt. You know, like, Rick and Morty, you know, <laughs> get up there, Morty. Wow. No, no, mine definitely was sexual twi twi twice over, um... Well... Apparently Rosé wasn't doing his job, so she decided to take her frustrations out on me, his wife, Chi-Chi Black, that bitch. Yeah, that, that bitch. Well, I can, I can imagine, I mean, the normal Chi-Chi angry is pretty bad, but Chi-Chi Black angry? I wouldn't like to see that. Yes, and, and, and they have the nerve to call me the manhole, but I was the assaulted one. Yeah, what have you done wrong? Nothing. Nothing! That's what I'm saying. See, I, it's, it's good to finally find somebody who shares my pain. I'm with you, Goku. I understand. We are the victims here. G gosh darn right. Of strong, independent, smart women are taking advantage of weak-minded men like us. We can't help it. You're damn right. You know what? We need to make a stand, Goku. It's a stand, especially with you here, because you're really strong and I'm not, so you can do all the heavy lifting. But I'm the thinker. I can make political satire. I'm with you on that. I'm definitely with you. Oh, by the way, I, I'm but with Neon Cut. Are you with me on this one? I'm with you on that one, Goku. I don't know what they are. Come, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Yeah! Victory! Um, what a great number. <laughs> 69! <laughs> oh my... I mean... Don't type it in Google, kids, but say... Do not, please, please, like... No, no. Ke ke keep it Disclaimer, family friendly. Disclaimer, don't do it. Fairly friendly. Yeah, don't do it. Disclaimer. Uh, do you want to read this one? This one seems like your thing. <laughs> Would you rather be one foot smaller than you are right, ra right now, or be one foot taller than you are right now? I'd rather be one foot taller right now, you know, like Frieza. You know, he wants to be taller, right? Yeah. It's the same kind of prospect for me, I mean, I'm only small. I'm, uh, I know my mother always said, Jocko, good things come to those who wait, or things like, um, good things come in small packages. That's all she used to say to me all the time. It never made me feel better. All the other kids were taller than me. I personally would rather be a foot taller as well. I mean, I'm average height already, but I think being a foot taller... You grew quick, though. I you grew, grew quick. I grew very quickly over, over three years. Whatever you are eating, dude, share it with me, cause I need to grow. <laughs> I will, I die, trust, trust me. I got, I got a nice little diet, I'll, I'll send you a copy. I'll probably die eating what you eat. Well, you know, sensible portions, no. So we both went with a foot taller, right? Yes. And here we go, and we won! Ah, uh, see, look, a majority vote! Nice, 80, 84%, I, That's I, a lot I of people. I think only tall people chose... I was gonna say, I was just 16% of the, this... Is clearly really tall people. I mean, yeah, <laughs> for those four tall people. Let's do two more. Um, would you rather have a stomach ache or have a headache? Oh, oh, oh that's a tough one. I've, I've had, had both. both. Um, hmm, I would probably say headache because you Earthlings seem to have an awful lot of medicine for headaches. 
I mean, you, you've got a lot of stuff for stomach aches too, but that's no normally some kind of liquidy gross stuff. At least with headaches, you just take a pill and boom. I'm always in the fetal position when it comes to the stomach stuff, so the headaches are so... Oh, they're so... Uh, yeah, but at least with a headache, you can move around. With a stomach ache, you kind of like... Fetal position, th th that's not going to go away, and... Sometimes you have to sit sit in the bathroom for a while, and you, you never know what's gonna happen with a stomach ache. With a headache, you know what you got. You know what you got with a headache. That is true. All right, all right, headache it is. Uh, you talked me into it. I talked you into it. See? That was close. That was a close See, that was one. that was really close. It was close, I can't blame yeah. anybody who chose this. This was really, really close. Yeah, it was close. Um, but yeah, here's- We need a tiebreaker. This will be the tiebreaker for all the portables! Okay. Here we go. Would you- What do we win? <laughs> I'm not gonna let you win. The, the, what do you win? I don't know. It's just for fun. It's all like good fun, Jocko. We need a prize? Go, go come on! We need a prize! Uh, I'll give you a picture of Bulma's boobs. How about that? Oh! Okay. Uh, uh, really? You, you like- you think Bulma's attractive? I mean, no. I, th I thought you said 17's boob. 17? What? Jocko! 18! 18. Oh. 17. Whatever. I don't know. Which one's the girl? Jocko, anything you want to tell me or something going on? Which one's the girl? It's 18. 18, that one. Jocko, like, please. I don't know the number. Sir, please. Sir, please. I don't remember. I've never even met 17. Ugh. I mean, to be fair, they look alike, so I guess it's an honest mistake. Yeah, I mean, I've never met 17. Alright, fine. Uh, would you rather live an average life and be forgotten in time or go down in history for something terrible? Well, as a galactic patroller, I would definitely live an average life to be forgotten in time rather than do something terrible. I'm not a I'm not about being terrible. I am for justice, sir. <laughs> well, that is true, but as I said, my average life is pretty long, so I'm gonna go with you on that. Average life. But then this doesn't end the game, does it? It means we're tied still. We'll do another one if we tie. Okay. Which we did. We're gonna tie anyway, because if we lose, we both lose. Fine, we'll, we'll go until somebody wins. We'll, how about that? Okay. All right. Okay. Here we go. Would you rather only be able to whisper or only be able to shout? Well, I feel only being able to shout would be... Better because if something really terrible happens and you can only whisper, you'd have to make sure you're pretty close to that person. And if you are, and something terrible is gonna happen, that's gonna happen to you too. I'm a shouter. So at least if you, at least if you shout, uh, yeah, I sh I shout too, quite often. So I'm I'm gonna go with shout. Nice. Uh, but if we keep picking the same thing, nobody wins. Next question. <laughs> Fine. And we lost. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? Wow, wow, wowie wow. Earthlings, ridiculous. It is ridiculous. It's totally ridiculous. God. Okay, this one's a good one. Would you rather get the swine flu or get West Nile? What the hell is a West Nile? Something that could probably kill you. Well, so can swine flu. So, what's the lesser of the two evils? I don't know what the... This, I know what the conditions of swine flu is, but I don't know what the conditions of West Nile is. I'm kind of interested in the West Nile. Okay. All right. Tiebreaker. You go with West Nile, I'll go with swine flu. May the best person win. No hard feelings. Okay. No hard feelings. Three, two, two one. one. Boom! Oh, come on! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> the Galactic <laughs> Patrol wins again! This is a... This That's is just... I, world is finally here! I demand a reach out! Reach out! Justice! Justice, baby! Justice! Oh, I can see everybody just, just blocking me. Goku, you lost to a space patroller! Yeah, you did. Fine, fine. But I concede. I'm a man of my word. I, at least I'm, I'm not like Vegeta, who can't admit defeat. I, I tip my muffin crown to you, sir. Tell me about it. I was just about to beat him in chess one day, and he just blew up the chessboard. Oh, I can, I can only imagine. Oh, I can, I can actually imagine it right now. It's kind of funny. I was a close second. I had to run back to the ship. True. <laughs> it's very, very true. But, I mean, I remember that one time I walked in on him. Well, I walked in on Bulbon getting out of the shower, and he blew a gasket. It wasn't my fault, and her boobs were saggy anyway, so what are you getting mad about? 
I know, right? Oh, oh. saggy boobs! I know! Oh. <laughs> Vegeta, apparently. <laughs> apparently, Jeets needs to, uh, he needs to massage those up, because, Gigi, can I just say, Chi-Chi's boobs are, are still flawless to this day. How, though? How is she able to keep them so perky? That's, that's, I mean, I, I mean, that's rude of me to ask, of course, but it's just, I'm curious. I, I can tell you, it's, um, I, I massage them every now and then, uh. Oh! Apparently massaging helps, it's like, it's like jazzercising the, the fat, and it really, really helps. Oh, it's just like boober size. Yeah! I <laughs> like that boober size. <laughs> you could say it was boobtastic. Oh, fant that's great. Can't, can't beat a, boob, a good boob. Get on, you cannot. Uh, but this was this was fun. This was actually a, a pleasant surprise, John. You're a cool guy. I like you. I like you. You're good. See, people just need to get to know me. Everybody just thinks I'm this whiny little guy who doesn't want to do anything. I'm more fun than people think I am. I mean, I'll I'll admit. Duck, I really didn't think of you that way. I just thought you were just some crazy space person who likes to... See, look. There you go. You never judge a book by its cover. And to be fair, Goku, you're a lot more fun than I thought, that, too. That's what I was gonna say. You thought I was just some strong guy. <laughs> I thought you were just some dumb strong guy who just wants to fight neat all the time. But you're pretty... you're pretty fun. See? See? See, guys? Let this... let this... see, this has a less... a message to it. Do not judge a book by the cover, alright? See? Exactly. Learn, you learn that lesson, kids. That's, that's a bridge Goku lesson today. Next time, next time on the show. But, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this. If you did, hit that thumbs up, like, and subscribe. And I'm gonna pass this over to my good friend, Jocko, here, to promote his channel. The floor is yours, Jocko. Take it away, buddy. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much for watching this episode of the Bridge Goku's Would You Rather featuring me. Uh, if you want to go and subscribe to my channel, it's you versus Matt. I'm sure the Bridge Goku will put it in the description below. Naturally. That's a good boy. Naturally. And, yeah, just come and subscribe. I do in voices like this. There's also Def the Kid. There's Natsu, Cells, Frieza. There are loads of people there. Loads of people. We're all there. Loads of them. Even Sonic. Why not, huh? Why not? So, yeah. Yeah, exactly. So, just come along. See if you like it. Anywho, I will see you all next time. Chaco, let's go have some muffins. Do you like muffins? I love muffins. How can anyone not like muffins? Thank you. See, thank you. See, that's what I'm talking about. Let's go get some muffins and I'll... Hey, look, look, look I tell you what. Come back to my spaceship. I got muffin button. Come on. Oh, oh, I like muffin buttons. Oh, wait. I got to get you your prize. Hold on. Here you go. Oh, <laughs> this is going... This is going right next to the picture I drew of my superior. I mean, I don't have any other pictures. So this is just going straight in the spaceship. Whatever you say, Jocko. I know nothing. I know nothing. Nope. And that's why I like you, Goku. See you later, guys. Bye! Bye!